Hello everyone and welcome to my second unboxing video. Uh, very excited, inside here is my very first real grade. I've never seen one or touched one. Um, so yeah, before we get into that, make sure you like and subscribe. Um, and if I get enough support, who knows, I may even show my face on camera one day. So let's get into it and see what we have. I tried to pick a real grade that uh, would just look super cool, make it really worthwhile getting. Like I said, I've never seen one or touched one, so it'd be good to compare to the high grade. So, I know what the little one is, first things first. We've got another little SD kit. I had to get a friend for Gundam 00, so I wanted to get a nice colourful one, nice and bright. We've got Justice from Gundam Seed. Wow, really nice um, kind of pink, maybe a dark pink colour there. And also the purple. But yeah, fantastic looking, beautiful colours. It's good to get something different. Not sure about any customising so far, but we'll get this one built and we can always decide later. We have a really good backpack on there, pretty big and chunky. So yeah, for an SD kit, um, another one that was just £9, uh, yeah, loads of and loads of kit on there. Looks really cool. The main one is the real grade. Here we go. We have got maybe the best real grade at the moment. Strike Freedom Gundam. Look at that. Pictures on the front there look so cool. Got the nice close up of the head. Loads of detail here. Lots of um, gold actually. So I don't know if the pieces, what colour the pieces are. I think we'll have to colour those gold for sure. And one thing I'm not quite sure about, this has got lots of decals on the picture, but I don't know if they're inside. So that's one thing I'm really looking forward to, is having something with decals. Do they all come with the uh, this packaging on? I'm not sure, but let's get into it. Before I do that, got a proper skeleton in there. Lots of weapons. The wings seem to have a lot of articulation. Right, brilliant. Let's get into it. And it is, it is bright, shiny gold. Very cool. Let's have a look at that up close. quality just like everything else. Run it ABS. Oh, that looks pretty good. I didn't know what to expect, I hadn't really looked at it closely, but as a starting point that is excellent. One of the main bags here. What have we got? <clears throat> Definitely going to be one of the biggest ones I've ever built. Tons and tons of parts, so it'll definitely take some time. But it's not necessarily a bad thing because uh, I'm spending money on these that uh, I shouldn't be. But hey, that's life. So this is a really dark, bluey, purple for the chest pieces. Whites as usual for legs and arms. Uh, these are like a probably a pink beam saber. Clear shield, very cool. And this, oh, this is a bit strange. So this is like golden yellow, but then other parts on here are different colours. Never seen that before. 
to look into that. That's yeah, very strange. See that how that all cuts out and looks. What does it say here? The advanced MS Joint Four. Wow. So already this is all beyond my expectations. So even in this kind of grey blue, just really nice colours, really nice texture. Very dark grey and red. Oops, and there we are, the V fin, which is pretty tiny, so there's a hell of a lot of parts, but at the same time, it's only going to be the same size as the high grade, so it's going to be very intricate. if the parts are more detailed than the high grade individually but there's definitely a lot lot more pieces and what we've got here so the, these are almost black A very dark, maybe even a purpley blue, very, very dark purpley blue. That's not a, not a bad thing because the more colours, the better. Nice big white runner here. Ah, there's a couple of head pieces. All important uh, face grill and a white V fin as well. Yeah, looking at these, the detailing on these does seem a lot more than the high grade. Oh, and also a little figure. There we are. Off the top of my head, I can't remember the name. As we all know, the series are rather confusing, so difficult to remember everything. I have watched all of Seed and Seed Destiny recently. Is it Kira? I think it's Kira. More golden parts. Ah, so we've got both colours here. So this is that very bright yellow gold. And the darker gold here, more of a matte colour. Spread out hands there. Ah, here we go. So there's two types, uh, three types of hands maybe. Two types. I haven't seen any others. Quite surprising though, having golden hands. Not seen that. And I'd say this is proper gold colour. The other one's more of a shiny yellow gold. beautiful and thank god we have stickers and water slides mixed on the same page here never seen that before so you've got a choice of eyes but yeah first time i've ever had water decals on gunpla and i really think they make all the difference so i'm so pleased it's worth the money just to get these Quick look at the instructions. Definitely a, a bigger, heavier book than the others I've built so far. More detail, a bit more coloration than the other ones. So in comparison, going from high grade to real grade, you might spend, what, 50%, 60% more, sometimes even double. From what I'm seeing at the moment, double does seem worth it. And because my first one, I probably won't do any painting on this. I'll just build it as accurate and as perfect as I can. If it 
fix anything like that, which it will do, it's going to be super duper cool. Still need to get a base, need a base. All sorts of movements, plenty of weapons, and oh, very nice. This, yep, yeah, this is for the decals. A lot of it in Japanese, of course. So it will definitely be taking a lot of time to get those all perfect. But yeah, absolutely brilliant. So from what I've seen so far, I definitely recommend real grade. Maybe I won't even buy any more high grades, just get the real grades. I suppose it's all about money, isn't it? So many parts. On first impression of the Strike Gundam. Yeah, really, really looking forward to it. Thanks very much. I'll see you again soon. Uh, I'm still working on other videos. But again, like and subscribe and you won't miss anything. Thanks very much.